Hosting a party can be a lot of fun, but also a lot of work sometimes. Yeah, if you're hosting a celebration to watch the Super Bowl game this weekend, you might be worried that you're going to spend most of the time in the kitchen and not actually watching the game. But fear not, because we have Ali Bedoun. He is the owner of Sicily's Pizza here, and he is going to show us some fun ideas on how to prep your game day spread so you can actually enjoy the game. Good morning, Ali. Good morning Good. to you and your viewers. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to be here. Thank you for We're being We're excited here. to have you here. I know. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> now you've brought in a bunch yeah. of goodies, which we're going to get to in just a sec. Everything looks amazing, and Thank Jason you. already said your chicken wings are delicious. Thank you. It's nice. But you're going to show us how to make something, right? Uh, yes, absolutely. Uh, first, um, uh, the, the key to success of a party is to plan ahead. Mm. Don't rush and then make stuff that doesn't hold. We've brought to you guys, uh, first of all, our pizzas, which is our highlight. Uh, never bleach, never made of flour, our sub platter, our homemade meatballs, and then our famous wings. Um, the key to making sandwiches is never dress them. Always leave the condiments off, put it on the oh. side. That way they hold for a long time. Then oh, that is an excellent tip. Really Don't put the Italian dressing on there and get it all soggy and whatever, sloppy. Whatever you use, then your guest can do, can do his things. The same thing with, with wings. Okay. Um, leave them really really dry, set up, set up a nice, fun, interactive uh, dressing station. So you can they just, can you put their own sauce. Absolutely. Your guest can just go and then feel like he's cooking even though he doesn't have to cook. Add some sauce, toss the wings a couple of times and here it is. Yeah, and when people do it themselves, well, I think it makes this. them yeah. feel like that they're absolutely. part of the process absolutely. too. That's a really good takeaway. Don't dress your food. Let never. it be dressed as people never. eat. So no that's the first time I've ever heard that. that I've never heard great that. Great advice. But then after he said it, it was like, oh, that makes the most sense ever, absolutely. right? Absolutely. <laughs> and don't, don't try to pro uh, Try to be a superstar chef and complicate in your dishes. Keep it simple. Uh, offer simple things that people can eat with their hands. For instance, the vegetables. Don't put a big salad that needs mm -hmm. dressings and forks and knife. Mm -hmm. Put a vegetable platter. Just people can pick with their hand if they want vegetables. Just dip. Dip and then use your hands. Watch the game. Again, set up before and then make it look festive. Mm -hmm. Bring in the decorations. Make people feel like, hey, if they can't go to the Super Bowl, that close enough at home, as close as it can be at home. I like that idea. So how far in advance do you think that we should be prepping? If you're doing it at home, the night before is enough. Okay. And then if you have hot food you're going to serve, you can partially cook it, hold it in the fridge, and then heat it close to the game. Okay. And cold foods like sandwiches and salads can be done 24 ahead advance time. Put it in the now these are your wings? These are our wings, yes. Mm. <laughs> do, you cater? Up. do you cater? Absolutely. We do cater uh, uh, for a special event like this, like Super Bowl parties, of course. If you have a, need a big spend, give us uh, one or two days ahead, uh, notice ahead. If you have mm -hmm. a small order, which is a lot of people have uh, holding small parties, you can call us right on, uh, on demand. But calling ahead and ordering, especially if you want a big platter of sandwiches sure. to prep for you, uh, so many wings or pizzas, give us a 24 a time. 24 hours ahead of time uh, notice, and we'll take care of it for you. I love These it. meat balls are all veal, all natural, local meat. Love veal, you said? 100% veal, uh, ma ma made in house. Look how legit that looks. No, Thank you. It's extremely like. Let me just tilt this up so you can get it around. And and you know, thanks for really bringing the big spread here. Of course, Everybody here at the station pleasure. is going to be very happy. Yeah, and and I and I love the takeaways. I'm just going to review them really quickly because you know I'm OCD. Do not dress anything. Absolutely not. Let Especially do the it. sandwiches, yes. Right. Wings. Do not start slathering the sauce on them. Do them as people are eating. Absolutely. And let them if if you have that the time and the space set up a small uh, uh, dressing station. They can it. spin their own wings and have fun with it. Yeah, no big salad, do the veggies. Where can somebody learn more about uh, Sicily's We are pizza? at uh, sicilysdetroit.com. We're located on uh, Werner in 25th Mexican town. We've been there for 30 years, uh, 30 short years. And uh, all our food is homemade, locally sourced as much as possible, uh, local bakeries, well, local meats. Ali, thanks again for bringing this all in. Thank you for having me. Everything. It was great. Yeah. Who do you like, Love Chiefs or Niners? Uh, I'm going to call the Niners. All right. Okay. By two scores. Oh, wow. Done. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means, but congratulations on 30 years. Thank you so much. <laughs>